The flames erased to the top of a hillside in a residential neighborhood around 10 o'clock last night, destroying one home and damaging six others. Tonight, News 8's Abby Alford has reaction from a homeowner who watched it all unfold and has more on what the state is doing to make sure you have an evacuation plan. This time last night, the flames were licking this hillside and the winds were warring. It's calmed down a bit, but we're still in this red flag warning. That's why there are state volunteers who are making calls to 2,000 San Diego residents, reminding them to be prepared and offering resources. The wind is like 50, 60 miles an hour. Embers just going everywhere. Neighbors jumping into action to save homes in the Willow Fire Wednesday night. I'm on this neighbor's roof with a hose. While Cal Fire does not recommend that you stick around and hose down your home, neighbors were grateful. I just thanked him. I didn't know this was, I didn't know what was going on. As prepared as you think you are, when you see those flames inching close to your home, you may panic. And it's like, oh, I remembered to pack my medications, but I forgot all the titles to my my house and cars. Karen Baker and a team of 500 volunteers called Social Bridgers are phoning in or texting Californians, having one on one conversations with residents in high fire areas on how to be prepared for evacuations. Bridger Mary Pierman lives in Lakeside and shares information from the county's disaster directory. This one older lady went up. Oh. You know, you talk about a backpack and I don't like backpacks because I can't carry it. And I said, well, do you have a roller bag? There you go. And she goes, yeah. I said, well, that's what I use. <laughs> These calls are critical as they found only one in four San Diego County residents are registered to receive disaster alerts electronically or by phone. So we need to get people to go to readysandiego.org. The California Office of Emergency Services Listos program, the first of its kind in the nation, launched during COVID as wellness calls to seniors and has evolved to disaster preparedness, making 56,000 calls so far. Volunteers are finding that both are crucial when there's fire danger during the pandemic. They're worried about their health and safety and where the next meal is coming from. They're not going to be prepared for a disaster. To take a look at the San Diego County Disaster Directory, just go to our website at cbs8.com and click on the help button. All right, Abby, thank you.